polyethylene it is also abbreviated as p so as name indicates it's a monomer is ethylene so this is ethylene molecule so when we take number of n number of ethylene molecules so because of this pi bond ethylene monomers monomer join together to get a chain of ch2 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 chain of ch2 groups and this is called polyethylene you can write polyethylene or you can write like this also so ch2 and ch2 n times so this is also polyethylene it is your choice uh it is actually lightweight lightweight and durable thermoplastic you know the meaning of thermoplastic if you don't know you check my previous video with variable crystalline structure if you see the monomers uh or this uh, this polyethylene you will get a crystalline structures you can you can see the uh, photograph of or you can see polyethylene crystals so this is crystalline structures variable crystalline structures so since this is very very popular polymer on the earth we can say uh we must know its detail so first of all we'll see the types of polyethylene there are two main types of polyethylene one is low density polyethylene you might have seen on plastic bag ldp is written low density polyethylene or another type is high density polyethylene it is also called as hdpe and more or less frequently they are also classified as mdp mdp medium density polyethylene very low density polyethylene vldp or high molecular weight polyethylene hmwp or ulmn mwpe means ultra low molecular weight polyethylene or cpe is chlorinated polyethylene so these are few examples of a few, cl few classes of polyethylene but these two are most popular that is low density polyethylene and high density polyethylene ldpe and hdpe you can forget you can it is not actually uh, these classes are not important they are less frequently used but you should know their names because of that only i have mentioned here now i'll consider it's a property and then uses very interesting a uh, low density polyethylene is a semi rigid and translucent you know plastic bags then it's having high degree of high degree of short and long side chain branching so branching is there so this is not actually linear there are some branching so you can join ch2 ch2 branch here you can join ch2 ch2 branch here of different size so side chains are either short or long but branching is there in ldpe and they are produced at high pressure you have to maintain high pressure if you want to have ldpe okay another use we are going to discuss uses these are very popular uses to prepare plastic bags you know plastic carry bags wash bottles tubing packaging industry or you can use as a laminator lamination or water pipes because of their flexibility and low water absorbing uh, tendency or property they uh, you can prepare flexible toys by using this ldp wiring and cables their uh, insulator as a insulating material or covering of cables or wires is actually made up of ldp so lot many uh, uses you can you can you can write here but these are the most popular uses of ldp polyethylene which is low density polyethylene apart from this i want to add lldp that is a low low density of uh, polyethylene which is actually the mixture of monomers we use and it's having different properties i mean uh, because of that only lldp is not included here 
Now you just watch here HDPE, high density polyethylene. High density polyethylenes are actually linear. There is no branching or very low degree of branching or low degree of side chain observed in HDPE. Because of that, they are high density. They are manufactured at low temperature and pressure. But LDP manufactured at high pressure. Now some uses of they are used for trays or bottles. You can uh, you can see bottles are actually prepared from high density high density polyethylene. They are uh, rigid as compared to this one low density polyethylene. You can prepare drums. So lot of uh, big drums you can prepare big cans or bulk containers for chemicals. Uh, you can prepare different housewares. Uh, you can prepare ice boxes, toys which are tough and rigid. Ropes you can prepare because of high tensile strength. You can prepare sports no uh, sports nets are prepared from HDP. So you can even uh, give lot of application. But I have selected only those applications which are most popular. So this is about uh, this is all about polyethylene. Uh, thank you so much.